I mean, there are some giants up there in the mountains and stuff. Even in Kentucky, like they're just they're different animals. They're not like farm country. No, yeah. you know, you get back up into the mountains. It's like they're they're a different animals. Those deer, are, they don't see people. That's why they react the way they do. And you probably have one shot at those guys, and then it's you know yeah. fairy dust. I don't, I don't think they're nearly like as as patternable either. I mean, the ones that I have encountered or experienced, like in farm country, it's like they're they're pretty okay. You know, here, here's the bedding thicket. Here's like that's where they're going to eventually. Like in the mountain, it just seems like there's just, there's so much like so much similar. Like every ridge is they're lined up like this, and leeward side the side with acorns, leeward side the side <laughs> yeah. with acorns. Mm-hmm. And yeah. they can just move 20 miles yeah. each way and get the same habitat. A lot of those deer that I'll see on the mountain, they'll end up moving in the next three weeks. They'll be moving. I'll get them on my camera behind my house. And they'll have moved a mile and a half, two miles. And they won't stay, but for a week or two, they'll yeah. they'll run that right. circle. 